Hey everybody, happy Monday. This is the week in review where I discuss the top five things I want to accomplish this week. So this is a series, it's usually the week ahead and then the midweek and the week in review. So if you watched the previous video for the week in review, you would know how big of a week I had regarding my Amazon Web Services Solutions Architect as well as project management. And that continues. So number one is looking for more project management opportunities as well as uh, completing uh, the current ones that I have. I'm very grateful that people have been watching my content and checking it out because the one thing I love about being a certified project management professional is it gives me the ability to teach and to guide people towards them receiving their own PMP. I know how receiving my certification has helped me. I've gotten opportunities, including the instructor position, because I am a certified PMP and have significant background in that. And I want the same for other people, whether or not it's the PMP. Whenever someone goes for certification, I know that they are dedicating a lot of time, effort, and money towards it. And I want to be the conduit. I want to be the guide to help them maximize their return on investment and get the same opportunities that I was able to receive in both the government as well as the private sector. So that's number one, project management. Number two, is Amazon Web Services. So yes, I wrapped up my Solutions Architect professional training last week. This weekend, I completed the Solutions Architect, the first practice exam. There's four. And my goal this week is to complete the remaining three just to go through the first run, as well as through my instructor's recommendation, learn more about the Amazon Web Services Developer Associate. Take a couple of classes in that through um, lynda.com and the reason why I think it would be beneficial is because I am a programmer and I know what it's like to code from scratch and knowing the commands um, gives me a deeper understanding of what cloud computing is specifically when it comes to Amazon Web Services. Also, the instructor recommended that there was some overlap there and it couldn't hurt. So just having more knowledge always helps me, especially on the job, as well as the certification exam versus not having it when you need it the most. Also, I am still actively looking for new positions. So that's going to be number three. Uh, having all of the experience from Amazon Web Services complements my already 15 years of technical experience of programming, big data and sys administrator. So I am looking for full-time direct hire remote Cleveland and DC cloud computing positions. And I have significant amount of knowledge in Amazon Web Services as well as systems administration. Furthermore, in addition to a PMP, I'm also certified Scrum Master, IDO 3 and 4 Foundation. So I have solid IT service management knowledge and have done work with uh, service uh, level agreements as well as ticketing services. So I have a lot of system admin experience. You can get in touch with me on my website, carlarchickens.com forward slash contact or connect with me on LinkedIn at linkedin.com forward slash I am forward slash Carlar Jenkins. If you're watching this, I put the links in the description. If you're also watching this on YouTube, you can click the bell icon and the subscribe to get more videos like this in social media, personal branding, and project management. So number four is my newsletters are coming out today, all three of them. Carla's Correspondence, um, which deals with social media and personal branding at carlarchickens.com forward slash mailing list. PM.project, which deals with project management bit.ly forward slash pm project mail and my um, positivity change post which deals with positive change in management because october is national gratitude month and you can sign up for to receive more positivity in your inbox this monday at positivitychange.com forward slash mailing list i put all of the links in the description that you can um, sign up for and then number five and this is something i truly love NaNoWriMo, which is National Novel Writing Month, will start November the 1st. So that's next week, Friday, I believe. 
And I do this almost every year. And doing NaNoWriMo actually helped me with my write my Amazon best-selling book of Expand Your Personal Brand. 20 tips that you can get at carlrjenkins.com forward slash expand your personal brand. But I love writing. I love to communicate. As you can see, whether or not it's video or on my website, carlrjenkins.com. And I'm looking way forward to that. So I just wanted to put that out there. That that's also something I'm doing. I don't know what my strategy will be, but the goal is to write 50,000 word novel in one month. And I'm currently working on my outline. And that's something I truly, truly love. So these are the top five things that I'm looking forward to accomplishing this week. I would like to thank everyone for watching me. Remember, the newsletters come out today. Sign up for them. Also, if you're watching on YouTube, hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to never miss any videos for social media or personal branding and project management. I'd like to thank everyone for taking out the time to watch me for this week ahead. And don't fear, I'm coming with the midweek this Wednesday. I'll see everybody in the next video. Goodbye.